According to the truck's driver Salim Musa, the vehicle brakes failed while attempting to climb the mainland ramp. It will take over five hours to remove the vehicle from the ocean. The vehicle was ferrying 60 tons of maize flour from Majengo Mvita constituency to Kunda Kwale County. Kenya Ferry Services took the opportunity to warn motorists of being keen at the channel. <laughs> Sasa singeweza kurejesha ile gari ndani ya feri maana ingewa watu. Kabidi nikaelekeza kando ikanguka kando. Elsewhere, leaders from Watamu area in Kilifi North Sub County have vowed to ensure the proposed construction of a 28 billion shillings 61 story building goes on as planned despite tourism cabinet secretary Najibalala's opposition. The leaders say the project if completed will be a landmark and a tourism booster in the region. <laughs> Na waziri mimi nitamuita bunge aje ajibu kwa nini anataka kupeleka mradi ule wapi South Sea In Kericho Kenya Highlands University Chancellor Dr. Robert Lagat is calling on the government to consider input from private institutions when implementing a 30 million shilling rural access road. The road is expected to boost accessibility and open up opportunities for movement of goods and people. Uh, a lot of uh, legislations and a lot of government policies that are being uh, implemented, particularly pertaining to education, are discouraging to the private sector. Outgoing British High Commissioner to Kenya Nick Haley has in the meanwhile reaffirmed his country's commitment to partnering with Laikipia County in terms of development. Speaking in Nanyuki town, Haley said Britain has a special interest in the region considering its soldiers train in the area. To commit the United Kingdom also to taking forward with this county the work that we are doing in livestock development, in urbanization, in making sure that Batak procures all of its services from the local community to create jobs. Lastly, legal aid from across Africa are calling for provision of legal service through paralegals and the use of alternative dispute resolution mechanism to reduce the backload of cases at the court. When um, uh, clients go to court, many of them are not represented and many of them don't even understand the justice system. And uh, then there's a lot that is in remand who are even worse, uh, um, affected much worse because they don't even have access to their outside world. This, as Kenya is reported to have made significant strides in ensuring justice at the community level is attained compared to other African countries.